A lot of people never tackle fish because they think it's too difficult, but once you've got the technique, it's actually really easy. Now, first thing I'm going to do, just get a little bit of Morton sea salt, crush it over the top like that. A little bit of pepper as well. And then turn it over. And there are a couple of things you want to check for. First thing is you want to make sure that it doesn't smell too much like fish, because if it smells really fishy, that means it's not very fresh. The other thing is you want to have a look at the skin and see if there are any scales on it. If there are any scales, then just get the sharp part of your knife like that and just scrape it against the grain of the scales and they'll just flip straight off. Next thing we need to do is just pinch it and then score into the skin diagonally. And the reason I'm doing this is because when I cook it, it means that it's going to cook it more evenly. Probably want to score it probably a good couple of millimetres into the fish. Like so. There we go. Right, bit of salt on that side as well. A little bit of pepper. And then a bit of olive oil into my pan, like so. Get it nice and hot. And then I'm just going to place my piece of fish straight into the middle. And then just press down with your fingers, don't be afraid that you're going to get burnt, it should be okay. And then just press it down so that it cooks nice and evenly. And then, we just need to leave it, resist the temptation to start poking around, because that's when the fish is going to stick to the bottom of the pan, it's all going to fall apart. You need to leave it there for probably about three minutes, it's on a really high heat, that's going to crisp up the skin, so it means the skin's going to be edible as well. Right, it's been a few minutes, and if you want to test it, we can just look underneath. And you can see it's beginning to brown off, but not quite. You need to leave it for a couple of minutes. If it's getting a little bit smoky, then you might want to put on your extractor fan. So. And that should take away a bit of the smoke. Right. I think that is almost there. Now the next step is we're going to just stick that straight into the oven. We're going to put it under a really hot grill and that's just going to finish it off on the top. Perfect. Right, to finish off the salmon, really simple. We're just going to add a knob of butter into the pan, like so. Check it out. And then just let that butter brown off in the pan. And then spoon the butter over your salmon, like so. Final thing, I'm just going to get some lemon. A bit of lemon juice. And that is almost there. Now we need to take our salmon out of the pan, place it on top like that, look at that, absolutely perfect. And then the next thing I'm going to do, and the final thing, is just zest a bit of lemon on top, like so.